Hi! Today I'll show you how anyone can easily fix a broken 3.5mm jack on Bayer Dynamic headphones. This guide and these tips and tricks can also be used for any headphones with a 3.5mm or 6.35mm damaged jack. To do this, you'll need to get a new replacement 3.5mm connector. You'll find links in the video description. Jacks come in different styles and prices. I'll use this one because it includes a screw-on 1 quarter inch adapter for headphone amps and has a nice metal spring strain relief, which helps the cable last longer. You'll also need to borrow some super glue from Grandma, a few basic tools, a soldering kit, and some heat shrink tubing. The first step is to cut off the damaged jack, leaving a few centimeters of cable. Then stretch the cable slightly to straighten it. Put on the new jack housing and measure how much outer insulation you need to cut off. Carefully remove the outer jacket without damaging the internal wires. Separate the wires by color and cut off the fabric threads. You won't need them. Next, do the same for the old broken jack. This will help you figure out which wire colors are for left, right, and ground. Also, cut a small piece of insulation off each wire. Then cut a piece of heat shrink tubing, stretch it bigger, and slide it onto the cable. Tin the wires from the broken jack so you can test them with a multimeter. Use a multimeter in resistance mode to find which wire is left, right, and ground. If you don't have the old jack or a multimeter, you can open the headphone's housing and check the wire connections inside to identify the correct colors. In my case, the black wire is ground, red is right, and white is left. Cut the black wire a bit shorter and strip it. Then measure how long the left and right wires need to be. Cut any extra length and tin both the wires and the jack contacts. Start by soldering the black ground wire and fix it in place using the jack's metal clamps. Keep in mind, the wire's color layout can be different on your headphones, so always double check it. Solder the red wire to the right contact and the white wire to the left contact. Apply a little super glue where the cable is fixed to the jack and slide the heat shrink tubing over it. Take grandpa's nail polish and coat the soldered contacts. This helps prevent short circuits. Add a bit more super glue, then tighten the jack housing securely. And congratulations, your headphones are repaired. You now have a brand new and even better 3.5 millimeter jack with a one quarter inch adapter. Finally, play my headphone left and right channel test video to check that both sides work. And enjoy that happy smile knowing you've just repaired your first headphones and saved a lot of money. I hope this was helpful and I wish you good luck with your repair.